I remember Steve arriving dressed like Darby O'Gill. I mean, it was extraordinary, you know, to see him in the flat cap, the three-piece suit, like thorn-proof suit. I think he had a shillelagh and this Irish wolfhound. I don't know where he got the Irish wolfhound. It wasn't his, like, you know, but he had an Irish wolfhound. And he got out of this green jaguar. And I couldn't believe it when I saw him coming. Like, I, I, I didn't recognise him at first, you know, and he, and he walks into the hotel. I knew something was going on, like, you know, whatever this was, it was part of a plan. You know, no one got underneath my skin. You know, I was always kind of objective. But he did a very good job. You see, he turned up, you got to remember, I'm champion of the world. So he turns up 45 minutes late. He comes dressed as an Irish countryman. He then proceeds to speak only in Irish. Excellent tactics. <laughs> 